Hey there, geographers and geologists. Today, we are looking at North Dakota geography, the Bakken Formation, and this is your walkthrough of the lesson. So first of all, our learning target, well, our goal is I can locate the Bakken Formation in North Dakota and explain some of the impacts of the Bakken Formation. So this video right here shows you where the Bakken Shale Formation is in North Dakota and gives you some background information on what is the process of fracking when it comes to looking for oil in the ground. Now, from here, what I actually want you to do is even before you watch this video, I want you to jump to page four, the first activity page. And right here on activity page four, we have a KWLS chart. So complete this KWLS chart to answer the question, what do you know about the Bakken formation in North Dakota? So in here, what are things that you know about this even before this lesson begins? What might be things that you want to know? What are some things that you learned after you've gone through the instruction and watched the videos? And what are some things that you still want to know? So jump to here right after you read your learning target and think about what do you know about the Bakken? What are things that you want to know about the Bakken? And then after you do your instruction, what did you learn? And what are some questions you still have? So again, this would be a great video to watch to get you that background information that you need to understand what we're talking about today. The Bakken Formation is a layering of sedimentary rocks under the surface of the earth. It's located nearly two miles below the Williston Basin of Western North Dakota. Billions of barrels of petroleum, oil, and natural gas are trapped in the Bakken Formation. For many years, oil companies had known that the Bakken Formation contained an enormous amount of oil and natural gas. They were not able to get these fossil fuels out of the ground because they were trapped in rock almost two miles down. By the year 2002, new technology had been developed that permitted oil companies to recover Bakken oil. A major oil boom called the Bakken Boom began in Western North Dakota. An oil boom means a number of oil wells are drilled in the area over a short period of time, and an enormous quantity of oil is produced. This brings the region a great deal of money. The Bakken has now become one of the most important sources of oil in the United States. North Dakota is the second largest oil producer in the country. Texas is first. About one million barrels of oil come out of the Bakken every day. This audio file will give you a lot more information than what is right here about the Bakken boom. And if you wanted to listen and follow along to the, um, to the North Dakota Studies website, this, if you click on this picture right here, it will link you to the North Dakota Studies website. And you can use that as part of your learning and part of the, your instruction in order to be able to do the activity. Um, Again, so you filled out your what do you know, what do you want to know. Now you're going to start to think about what are the things that you're learning about the Bakken and what are some things that you still want to know. Beyond that, on activity slide five, you need to move the Bakken formation from the perimeter of the page to its appropriate location in the Williston Basin. And then you have to answer this critical thinking question. Why doesn't eastern North Dakota have oil wells? On slide six, if you're looking for more information about the geology of the Bakken Formation, um, this is an interesting scientific video to learn about the geology. Uh, this is an interesting video about what happens with the natural gas in the Bakken Formation and how you can see what's happening. Uh, this is a great video produced by the North Dakota and Montana Public Broadcast Network that talks about the oil boom on the basin. And this is an interesting video that kind of talks about some of the 
um, some of the pros and cons about um, fracking for us as citizens. I'm going to jump back to slide four for a second, our first um, activity slide. And to help you out here, one of the things that I did was I, I gave you some starters. So when you look at your, what do you know? What do you want to know? What did you learn? What do you still want to know? I gave you some starters. Like maybe some of these are things that you already know. Um, and so you, like, you know this is what an oil rig looks like. So you could move that to things that you already know when you're starting your lesson. Um, maybe there's some things here that you don't know and you want to know more about. And so you could move those into want to know, or maybe some of these are things that after you do the instruction, you can move them into the learned area. I also left these boxes open so that you could click here and you could type whatever you wanted for yourself um, that maybe you still want to know or something else that you learned. Or again, you could just click right here and type into the boxes. But I gave you these stems as starters in case you didn't know where to begin. Just trying to help you out there because your goal today as a geographer and as a geologist is that you can locate the Bakken formation in North Dakota and you can explain some of the impacts of the Bakken formation.